Hello, hello, and welcome back to uh, the day seven of our calendar. Yes, seven, one week already, and it's getting closer to Christmas. And um, yeah, maybe I should start thinking of buying Christmas presents. And it's always the difficult question what to buy to your wife this year. Well, maybe I should go for the classic one and buy some nice lingerie, some underwear. I bought her some G-strings, but uh, this year I think I will go for the T-string. So, she might be happy with that. Yeah. We will see. Well, what I wish for this year, I really don't know yet, but I will think of something. But until then, uh, let's check uh, the calendar and uh, see what's behind uh, the door number seven. Oh yes, this is in the northern part of Italy. This is taken the summer of 2015 when I was down there and it's a place called Aosta um, and at, that, um, at this time when that picture was taken it was the biggest supercharger in Europe with 14 stalls and I must say a very pretty one uh, you know the roof above it uh, with the solar panel on top and the high mountains around and uh, stuff like that it is a very similar one in Denmark, uh, just uh, outside the main capital uh, of Copenhagen, a place called Kyrgyz. and But it has 12 uh, chargers instead of um, 14. Anyway, it's, it's the same with a nice roof above. We don't have this in Norway, not yet at least. Uh, but I find this very pretty, and a beautiful uh, thing. Um, charger and when I was there <clears throat> I was not alone it was another guy there from Norway <laughs> yeah uh, well this was in 15 so maybe now more Italians will use it but uh, back then yeah no one did anyway it was a pretty day in July and it was really nice and uh, it's a good memory, it's a beautiful place and uh, I hope I will come back one day and discover more of the northern part of Italy. Well, um, some of you might uh, wonder uh, what the P stands for uh, when you see a car. Uh, it does not stand for Parmesan or Pizza, uh, it stands actually for Pursuit. Because the Tesla is so fast, so you can pursue anyone and uh, overtake them at all the time. And actually, um, I heard that some police have actually gotten a Tesla Model S. I don't know in which country, but um, I read it somewhere. And uh, yeah, that might be a good thing. In uh, Germany, they have Porsche, uh, the police. Uh, but the Tesla is also pretty good, probably, I think, as a police car, so why not? Anyway, uh, that's all we had for today, and uh, tomorrow uh, we will talk more about um, the strange and cool world of Tesla and some good memories to look back on. So until then, have a nice evening, and uh, maybe you should start thinking about Christmas presents you to, uh, to give to people. That's it for now. Have a nice one.